up uh, across central Alabama. Temperatures are expected to be a little bit above average over the uh, the next few days. Actually, today we'll get into the mid 70s with sunshine. Clouds will start to roll in though overnight tonight and we'll see a few showers during the day Friday, but we continue to have at least a slight risk for some severe storms Friday night to end through early on Saturday morning. And then overall, much of the weekend is expected to be rain free. So once we get the storms out of here, Saturday morning and Saturday afternoon and Sunday look to be pretty nice. Here's a look at our future cast. So we'll start you off around one o'clock this afternoon. Plenty of sun, but here come the clouds. You can see them increasing overnight tonight, and that will help to keep temperatures uh, a little bit warmer for tomorrow morning at daybreak. And speaking of daybreak, there may actually be a few showers around during the uh, the morning hours tomorrow and really through the day. I don't think there'll be a lot of widespread rain, and we're certainly not expecting anything severe during during the day on Friday, but some scattered showers possible and then our focus will really turn to the other uh, storms that will be ongoing to our north and west tomorrow evening and into tomorrow night as that line starts to move into our northwestern counties, likely around midnight or after that. Uh, by uh, 2 a.m. on Saturday, you can see it starting to make some progress into our northwestern counties, and then it will continue to slide south and east from there. So let's look at our storm timeline for Friday night into Saturday morning. Uh, we've gone with a 10 o'clock start time just in case we get any individual storms to develop out, out ahead of the main line that'll be coming through. And so we think between about 10 and 2 a.m. for Haleyville and Hackleburg, Double Springs, back through Detroit and Seligent, and then between between about 11 and 4 a.m. for the 5920 corridor. So that would include Carrollton and Aliceville and then Brookwood, Tuscaloosa, up toward Pleasant Grove and Bessemer, Birmingham, and then up through parts of uh, Etowah and St. Clair counties. And then after two, that's going to be shifting south and east of us. Beautiful skies out there. We're currently in the mid 60s. Temperatures will climb into the mid 70s for later on this afternoon. Uh, so a really pretty day. A few showers around tomorrow. As I mentioned, it will be breezy with some showers during the day, but most of those storms come in uh, really late tomorrow night and during the overnight period, and they're really expecting an outbreak of severe weather to our west. But we've got that slight risk of damaging winds, maybe an isolated tornado or two, but then nicer the rest of the weekend. Sarah? All right, thanks so much, Jeff. Well, we still have a lot to get to this midday, including the right.